episode three of The Penguin is called Bliss, and it is directed by Greg Zobel, written by Noel Valdivia, and showrunner, executive producer Lauren LaFranc, starring, of course, Colin Farrell, as Oz, and uh, Renzi Feliz as Victor Aguilar. Bliss refers to the name of the drug that is created uh, mysteriously uh, from Arkham uh, that um, Sofia, played by Kristen Miliotti, brings in to infiltrate the streets, the party uh, culture of Gotham. This is going to be the new secret weapon to take over and uh, control the other mafia families with this new drug so that's what the title is in reference to bliss but it might as well be uh it's also a motif of the show in regards to the relationships of victor and oz the decisions that victor makes you know when you think of bliss and think of harmony and love and peace in regards to uh your family and uh, your loved ones and uh, maybe a new love and we get that bliss right away in a flashback scene that timelines with the ending of the batman in regards to another point of view of the dams being exploded by the riddler and what it does to victor's neighborhood the devastation and the family loss you're on a high in regards to Victor's character sharing time with his loved one, uh, Graciela, on a rooftop. And they're going to watch the fireworks. And instead, they watch the bombing and destruction of their neighborhood. An absolutely uh, just shocking beginning to this episode. And I got to tell you, this is pretty much a perfect episode in regards to writing storytelling and uh a pace wow the relationship between oz and sophia are also uh you know takes on a new level because they become uh erstwhile partners in this venture of bliss and trying to get it out and they they go after the asian triad to be their backers there's a, there's a couple of maneuvers that they have to go through there but there's this continuing theme of trust that sophia does not have for oz and we're going to finally probably see in the next episode as to what oz did or didn't do to get her committed to arkham uh, about 10 years past absolutely incredible uh, episode as i said Finally, um, this realize this. There's a lot of story here with Victor's character, and this character is so likable. The good heartedness of this of this um, series that he crosses a line that you just can't come back from. And he makes that decision at the end of this episode. It's a little heartbreaking. It's a little exhilarating. You know, cannot lie. He he chooses a life of being a, a gangster's driver with Oz, and instead of uh, meeting up and leaving town with uh, the love of his life in Graciela, maybe she'll return. What's interesting is that both of them in this episode uh, leave their 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 partners, their female partners, whether it's a. Uh, past love affair with Sophia, now turned business partner. Uh, Oz does does abandon her at the end somewhat in regards to a mafia situation saved by Victor. And then, like I said, Victor leaves uh, Graciela literally at the bus station where she's saying, come with me, let's start a new life. All our loved ones are, are, are gone here. Uh, so much, uh, so much great story. So much... Uh, fantastic uh, characters in what has become really now the tv show of the year and uh, who knew and we are all in with the penguin that is uh those are my takes uh, the three episodes out of eight now have been uh released i strongly suggest uh, you catch up and uh, this is uh probably 
again, the best genre television, definitely of any Marvel or DC that you're going to see, that we have seen, uh, period. And I, I even tweeted for Marvel and Disney and Star Wars to sit down and take notes on this uh, excellent television show. Let me know what you guys think of this show. And uh, we will be back next week with another uh, review and first impressions. Wherever you're at, keep your slant fuerte. Gracias. <laughs>